Hey everybody, so I am back today for my first work in progress for my, the Get It Painted Challenge by Etic Beer. And um, what I've got here is I have just done the first base coat of skin tone on um, the First Nations uh, Indians from Musket and Tomahawks that I'm painting. Um, it's interesting because I probably haven't painted natives um, for the game for about a year and that was the first time I did it and so I actually had to go back and look at some of my old videos just to kind of remember the exact proportion I knew what paints I used but I didn't remember exactly what proportion I did I think that's one of the good reasons that some people do diaries I actually don't I've never done diary I've um, on and, and written down my paint schemes I pretty much go by memory and but at times having a YouTube channel is really helpful for that purpose um, one of the things I, I noticed in that video that I kind of told people a little bit of the wrong, I, I actually said model color when it was game color for one of them, but basically what I do is um, I use this uh, game color tan and then um, I use dwarf skin game color and I go 50% each as my base coat. Um, I thinned it down a little bit. I didn't do it in the past, sorry about that hit the camera. Um, I didn't do, use this in the past, but since then I've been using this Laram and uh, Medium at times, and so, um, or Lamian Medium. And so I use this a little bit just to thin it. Um, but basically the scheme that I'm going to do is I'm going to use that as my base coat. Um, then what I'll do is a highlight with um, two of dwarf skin to one of tan. And then finally, I'll do just a very, very, and that's a very watered down highlight, um, very thin highlight. And then I'll do another thin highlight of basically one of tan, two of dwarf skin, and just, I would say one, but maybe even a half of um, this Averland sunset. I find that gives it a nice natural look um, that I, I, I enjoyed last time. It made a difference. It's interesting. I'll show um, the leader the guy that's meant to be the leader of all of the Indians that I paint, you know, past, present, future for the game. Uh, it's quite dark, um, and it has a, definitely a reddish hue to the skin tone. Um, the Woodland Indians typically are were fair, were, were fair compared to, let's say, like a Western um, Indian our native tribe in the west of the US um, and uh, I think that this color is nice and it might even be something that I would work up to or um, if I was doing let's say like a, a Plains Indian tribe um, but it's definitely just a base coat and, and I'll lighten up from here to for the for the woodland Indians um, but yeah, like in the future, if I do Apaches or something like that, like I think I'd probably be, I wouldn't be going through this process, but I would still use this tan. Um, it's kind of a very nice reddish hue to it for skin tone. Um, I think it looks good. Um, so beyond that, um, I don't think I have anything else really to, to update on. Like I'll just do those highlights and then, but, but next up won't be the highlights. I'll actually just start blocking in all the other colors for the clothing and, and various other things and, and then highlights will likely come later. So um, hope everybody's working away on their painting projects as well and I will talk to you later.